I have a, a little traveling guitar that was um, it was signed by the headsman, the evil headsman uh, Wilco Johnson plays in Game of Thrones, and he signed it. The minute he signed it and gave me a little lesson, I went up in level another 15%. He's, he put some uh, berry dust in it or something. I keep it in a special locker in my boat, and I play to the dolphins occasionally, but they don't like Johnny Cash. Terrible, scary films. I just, I don't watch them. I started watching, like, The Descent. No chance. That messed me up for a few years. That actually affected my putting for a while, because I'll just be in a place where it's two or three days walk to the nearest road or person or house and if I get a scare in the middle of the night I mean, there's nowhere to run. I haven't really done a scary horror film myself, I wonder what I'll be like, you know, and action. <laughs> Sometimes, bizarrely, it works for a Scot. See if you put on the bagpipe music and you know you're going in for a fight, you're ready. You're ready. And the pipes are still skirling through your head, you know, bring it on. Highland Charge, here we come. <laughs> now, I've had other jobs where it hasn't been rehearsed. That was Alexander. 200 guys coming towards you and 60 elephants, and it's, you pick that guy there and I'll pick that guy there, and when it, when it comes, it just goes crazy, and the dregs just going, keep rolling, keep rolling, and suddenly there's been a real fight. I think Stone liked the mayhem. He never said cut, but that's quite exciting, to be honest. I've got a friend that used to be a Trekkie and used to play when he was crossing the Atlantic, he used to play uh, Trekkie music um, movies on the mainsail at night time and watch that. I think you'd be a Trekkie after watching a few films like that. Yeah, but I like sort of swashbuckling films, something like that, you know, maybe pick up some, some tips how to cut off a head differently. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.